Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode on the Windcraft server. This is going to be episode 4 and first things first, I want to naturally go use up these infested pit keys. However, first I wish to run into here and I'm actually going to use a couple of these Witherheads ribs that I got in the previous episode to buy the rib cage. I'm not purchasing this because I want the item or that the item's a good item. I'm purchasing it so that I can wear something that doesn't give me minus 2% loot bonus temporarily. So I'm going to equip that and then I'm also going to wear my treasure boots to get me some more loot bonus to get more chances at good loot from some chests and we're going to go ahead and go loot a few of those real quick to try and get ourselves some upgrades to our armor before we go and tackle this dungeon. Ooh, actually, while we're at it, let's go ahead and grab Bob's tier, and let's run into the castle, since we're already here, and let's go do this secret discovery. And there we go. In we go! Hello, Ragni's secret library. It's only 80 experience, but... It's a little secret discovery and it has a lot of lore. I look over here, I have 33% loot bonus. Fingers crossed that nobody has looted this chest because I really, really would like to be able to loot this. It's there, but is it there recently or for a while? Looks like it's been there for quite a while. Nope, someone looted this recently. And... Spear, helmet, chest plate, and I'm gonna grab this tier two over here. This one scales with your level, so it can actually have some really good stuff in it. Further along than one might expect, even though it's only a tier two. See, look at that. And it's level 16 to 20. Ooh, hello. Another key guardian. Gimme. Alright, sir. Let's identify all this stuff. Get rid of all that. And identify these. 12% to reroll this morph topaz, which is 160 still. Same as it was last time. 9%. That's an upgrade. What can I get today? Boom. No legendaries again. Damn. I wonder how many tier 2s are in this forest. Because any tier 2s out here would be insane. The amount of loot they'd have in them. Another legendary! It's a chest plate. It's lower level, but I could actually use that. And then another Bob's tier. This is from a tier two chest this time. Hell yeah. All right, what do we got? Ooh, another one. Fuck. Why is it a relic? I can't use that. Fingers crossed. Boom. Oh, geez, that is four. Morph Topaz, okay. Um, definitely gonna want those over some of the stuff that I have currently. Go ahead, we're gonna identify all of those. Let's see what we get. Perfect cool. All right, item identifier. Let me identify these four Morph Topaz. There's a perfect. Let's go ahead, the relic 64 emeralds to identify it. Ugh. Probably not a good idea. All right, 59. Why does this less to identify? What do we get? All right, I don't have many emeralds. I've got 76, but I've got a bunch of morph topaz that I can go sell. So I'm gonna throw a perfect one on there for. 
1500. I'm gonna throw a 9%. It sold for 1500. Okay then. I just wanted to see if it would. There we go. So those should sell, but now we've got a whole bunch of emerald blocks and I need to buy from market. Buy. And there we go. 1000 XP and Wind Dungeons 1. We'll do that in a little bit. And what do we got in this chest? Boom. Nothing. Hello, Captain Enduin. At ease, soldier. Good timing. We need more manpower. Mm hmm. Plagued by spider vermin. Tides are about to turn. We found the nest. I'm probably getting past the wall. Easiest way would be lava. Fire and magic seem to do nothing. Give me a bucket. All right. Let's head on to the cave behind me. It would be up there. Let's go get some lava for this man. Flaming spiders continuing to fall. These ones creating lava somehow. Parkour. All right, give me the lava. Ooh. Burn down the webs. I do have a knack for spider killing, indeed. There we go. Andrew 50 XP. I got another key, so that gives us eight infested pit keys. So there's actually nothing I want from here. Interestingly enough. But we're gonna do the dungeon just to grind some XP. Into the dungeon we go. It's on level. The previous dungeon we did, we were over leveled for it. This time around, we are on level. Poor babies are starving, but what shall they feast on? How about you? Nah, I don't think so. I don't think your babies get to feast on me. So I need 26 tokens. Not high enough level for that potion. It's a level 20 potion, okay. I'll get level 20 during this dungeon completion, I'm pretty sure, because I think I'll get 19 before I beat the boss. Then maybe just doing the dungeon will get me 20. shot. Damn it. Alright. Nope. Overshot again. Yeah, I'm not trying that last jump. <laughs> Alright, I need 20 tokens. Killed them all. Onward we go. Another parkour. We're down to one potion and then a potion that I can't use. Yikes. I really do not want to die here. Yeah, I have a stun effect on that. Perfect! Literally right as I killed the last dude over here. Okay. So, let me use these on agility. Gives a slightly higher chance of avoiding getting hit. Whew, alright. Fingers crossed. Come on, let's do this. 
I'm not getting hit much because I'm stunning everything. And there we go. 500 XP from the boss and yep. Dungeon completion did in fact level us up. 4,600 XP. That's a pretty um, hefty amount. And then we managed to complete that dungeon, which completed our objective as well, which... No, oh, it didn't give XP. It just gave access to this, which I can click to claim my reward. Boom. Look at that. Hello, sir. Take my key. And into the dungeon we go. Oh, and there we go. All right, we've gotten a new spell. We've just earned multi-hit. And, oh, shit, we also got a legendary. Ah, f it's a bow. God damn it. There's two legendaries that I can't use today. Man. That really sucks. But... We've unlocked multi-hit, which doesn't really look too impressive when there's nothing to hit with it, but it is insanely powerful. I'm super excited to use it. Into the fight once again. Where are you at? There you are. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Shit. There we go. Gotcha. Alright. Any item drops? No more legendaries. We got a studded leather tunic. That's no use to me. And another kill incoming. Come on, die. Yeah, there we go. Kill the boss again. Boom. Another 3900 XP. Nice and easy. This time we got a wand or staff, whatever it is that I don't care about, and unidentified chest plate. And here we go. Dead. Level 24. Get a bunch of money again, which the emeralds are practically worthless now. What is oh, this? A bow. Hello. We got us an item, in addition to the ones we got from doing the dungeon itself. And she dropped a bow, but the bow was literally useless. Time to level up to level 25. There we go. That's level 25. I'm just going to ditch the potion. Vanish will upgrade in one more level. Unfortunately, we will not get that level here today. All right, into the boss fight we go. Ooh, and my, one of my Morph Topaz has sold for 1,500, one of the 9% ones. And come on, you're stuck in the soul sand. And there you go. That was our final one. Victory is ours. Alright. Identified leggings. Alright, so we've got a whole bunch of stuff to go identify now. Got a bunch of emeralds, we got some stuff to claim. I'm gonna ignore that entirely. I don't have a scroll to teleport me, so we have to run there, but that's fine. Uh, Nemract would be the closest. We just go on the trail. Yep, yeah, let's just head to Nemract then. And Nemract. Hello. 
Oh, jeez. And with the money we have, we should easily be able to identify everything. Unfortunately, that bow is not going to be useful to me, but it might be something I can sell. Let's do all of these. Oh, can't do that. Boom. Ooh, equilibrium. We're going to go equilibrium. Oh, what? Uh... Someone just threw a bunch of morph topaz on the ground. Um, even if I, they aren't super useful to somebody, uh, and he redid like he rerolled all of them once, but um, I could still sell those for a tiny bit, a couple hundred easily. So I'll take those. Yeah, gimme. They're just sitting right there on the ground. I ran into them by accident. Was not intending to, but I will gladly take them. 339 emeralds. Yep, I got plenty. Okay, we've got four morph topaz that I didn't expect to get. Uh, I'm gonna take that 12 and I'm gonna reroll that because I have 1.5 thousand. I think I should have enough to do it. Eight hundred to reroll that again. I'm gonna YOLO that one time. Worth it. That was worth it. Got another perfect one, which I previously was it like insta sold for fifteen hundred, so I should probably sell that for higher. My trades, let me get my 1500 emeralds. Let's sell the perfect one. I'm gonna try 3000 and just see if it sells. And then we'll throw an 8% on. How much did I do? I did a thousand for those. An 8% on for 1150, which makes it 1207. Yeah, that's fine. Alright, and we'll just leave those and hope that those sell. For now, we've gotten 2,000 emeralds. We have half of a liquid emerald. And it seems like a pretty good place to end the episode. So I would open my little daily crate, but I don't have that yet. I won't get that for another two hours, so I'll just open that off camera unless I get something really cool, then I'll just add it to the tomorrow's video. But I thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you all in the next video.